Maybe you're thinking about uh, creating your personal brand and growing your personal brand. And uh, in this video, you will see why personal branding is very, very important uh, and why you should start now, today, to create content for your personal brand. A lot of people think that this is nothing powerful or is just making some video. But uh, the basic of this business model and creating a personal brand on social media is amazing. And in this video, you will know what are the best ways and how you can start today uh, creating the perfect uh, um, personal branding profile with all the tips and tricks and platform to use. So the first thing to, to think about uh, uh, personal branding it's uh, your why. Find your passion. Just think why I start a personal brand. For example, me, it was to uh, create more freedom, create more income and uh, increase uh, my business uh, in general. It's um, nothing related to a specific passion, but I like entrepreneurship and business. And this for me, it's a new challenge to create content and have a personal brand business. Uh, first of all, you should sh show the right platform. Depends on what your personality type, what your content, what's your goal. Depends on a lot of variables. But uh, maybe if you are very, very shy and uh, you don't want to put your face into a camera, you should absolutely start maybe with Instagram or Facebook that uh, you can post just uh, some, cor some short video, some pictures and some stories. But uh, if you are more open to new experience, to new challenge, you can absolutely start a YouTube channel or do videos for your platform. It can be Facebook. There are a lot of people that succeed on Facebook using videos. The same thing with Instagram. It depends on your personality. But uh, my overall advice is to start on one platform and then bring your followers around all the platforms. For example, if you start on Instagram, uh, create also a YouTube channel and a Facebook page. And then you drive people from Instagram to YouTube and Facebook. The next point that uh, this is pretty much the most important for me and uh, is that you overcome the fear of the camera. Because uh, about one year ago, I was very, very shy. And uh, if you go on my channel, you go to see my first video. I was sitting here on my desk and uh, I was filming me with a webcam. I was wearing a hat because I was very, very shy. And uh, I made the camera setting really, really small in the corner of my computer screen. But then uh, once I started becoming more, uh, more good speaking and uh, a little bit more courageous, I started to expand the screen and now you can see me full screen. And uh, I have pretty much overcome the fear of uh, camera and this, year, this really helped me in public speaking. When I do some courses or when I go out and speak to a business meeting or just speaking to friends, people and uh, new people that I met, I am really more comfortable because uh, I pretty much uh, train myself to speak to a camera every day and this can be a really turning point for your career. The next point is uh, that uh, if you are introvert this really helps you. Uh, nothing for just the camera but also to share what's about you, your think, uh, what do you do during daily basis, maybe on Instagram if you are very shy, if you are introvert, you don't show to people what you are doing during the day. But with personal branding, you can start posting Instagram stories about your routine and people will find you very more interesting because they see all the things that you do. Maybe you read, maybe you work out, maybe you go run when it's raining. And this really uh, create a good perception of you in the mind of the other people. And uh, my advice to you is that if you are shy, this is the reason that why you should start personal branding. Without thinking to money or other stuff, you should start as a challenge to create content and put yourself online uh, 
so you will know more people and you will uh, increase the ability to speak with other people. The next point that uh, it's a really important thing but uh, it's more on legal stuff is that the people can take away pretty much everything for you but not your knowledge and your name and uh, what do you need to create a good personal brand your name and your knowledge it's really simple and even if you go maybe bankrupt you lose your home you lose your car you lose your job you lose your friends you can always have a, a personal branding and create growing that personal brand because uh, you can share your experiences, your advices, uh, maybe what you do on a daily basis. Um, and your name is attached to you. You have your ID document with your name and nobody can steal your name. Yes, there can be people with the same name, but uh, your name is pretty much unique. The next point is uh, that this uh, will increase your self-esteem because uh, you will find other people like you, maybe they are growing a business, other people that are getting in shape, losing weight, they go to the gym and this, is, this really makes you feel better because you know that you are not alone but there is uh, a lot more people like you that go on the same journey. And maybe you can share tips with them, speak uh, and maybe speak about uh, some topics that you don't speak with your friends and family. Maybe some topics about uh, specific business or specific tips uh, in, um, in what's your passion. And uh, uh, once you can see that you have more followers on Instagram, YouTube, Facebook or Snapchat or whatever social media platform that you want, uh, you will see that you start feeling, I can say, a little bit um, more happy, first of all, because you're helping people. Uh, through this YouTube channel, I helped some people, I can see in the comments, and some people write me on Instagram, and uh, maybe they ask me some quick tips uh, or they thank you me for for the information that i put out and uh, i am really happy to help other people achieve success and uh, avoid the mistake that i have made and really makes me feel uh, very good and uh, the same thing when maybe i post a video and i see that it gets a lot of view i am very happy because i know that uh, the work uh, of the day before uh, scheduling the video creating the thumbnail and everything in place uh, it's worth it the second point, uh, not second, the seventh point that uh, I want to share with you today is uh, that you pretty much contribute to help others. It's like uh, you are like a teacher, you are like a, a guru, you are like a, a person that people will uh, find information in you and uh, there is nothing better because uh, if someone tells me a great tip a great advice in the gym or doing my my business i will be grateful forever to them to share me that tip that really maybe saved me some months of my life to to succeed earlier or it saved me tons of money and uh, other stuff the next point is uh, that with personal branding you have unlimited potential if you are maybe thinking to start a business but you don't know what type of business this is the best business model because you can start from zero exactly zero money zero experience zero and uh, you can scale on to, to a millions or billions of numbers for example you can see that uh, the big people like logan paul he started from zero and with his personal brand now is one of the most famous people around the world and you can do the same thing youtube and the internet has an infinite potential and uh, you put the work you create a good content and uh, you will see that people will follow your page and will share your content but make sure that your content is good now i am a little bit improving uh, if you go to see my first videos, it was not uh, really good. Now, it's, I cannot say that it's amazing or it's very good, but it's better than the first video. So, my goal is to always growing. 
Uh, so after say this, I can say that starting your personal branding, it's pretty much free because as you can see now, I am filming with my phone. Okay, I have a tripod, but uh, I have uh, paid about 100 bucks this tripod, but uh, I can also shoot videos with my arm or without a tripod. For example, my first videos was without it. And uh, you can just uh, have your phone and use like a vlog camera, create Instagram stories uh, uh, where you share what you do, what you are doing, uh, and uh, maybe you're thinking uh, your daily tasks. And uh, doing this, uh, first of all, you will spend uh, a lot more time thinking, uh, okay, now I should have an interesting life. So you start doing something that is more interesting. And it doesn't mean that you it should be expensive, go out and maybe take a supercar, but just maybe go walking for a walk in your local area, film around and uh, see, say really good words about business and uh, really interesting topics. This can help you to start your personal branding for free or just uh, bring people, bring guests uh, in your channel or in your videos and um, start asking them questions so you have some content. Um, the next point, uh, it's uh, the last one and it's really powerful and important. But uh, this comes uh, not at the beginning, it will come later and it's the connections because uh, I have seen that a lot of YouTubers uh, create collaboration and can connect with other successful people just uh, for the numbers that they have on their channel. If I have a 100k channel, I can go out maybe an uh, exclusive party for influencer or meet people or uh, text to famous people to maybe do a collab or something like this. So this is a great opportunity to you to start today creating your, uh, your personal brand. My advice to you is to don't think about make it perfect the first time. Just create a video, create a picture, create a little plan of content of what uh, you are doing maybe the next one, two or four week. And, uh, and then nothing to say. Leave a like, start today doing something and see you in the next video.